Hello YouTube and this is a requested video of how I get my HD PVR quality and this video was requested by a guy called Pole Dancers one and a couple of other people so yeah uh, shout out to them so first of all you wanna um, open up Sony Vegas and then you wanna import um, a clip I'm just gonna import a random clip here first thing you want to do when you import, you want to right click on the clip, go down the properties and disable resample and uncheck maintain x spec ratio if you're wondering why I sound weird it's because I've got a blocked up nose so yeah I talk like there's a dick in my throat okay first of all we want to look at the project video properties you have, it has to be 1280 by 720 720p 59.94 frames per second 8 bit Best, Gaussian, none, and make sure these two boxes are unchecked. The audio, um, make sure that this is on best. And that's basically it. Click apply and click OK. Okay, first things first, um, I'm just going to split this clip here. Okay, what you want to do is go to video effects, go down to color corrector, and you want to drag that in and um, what I'm going to do is in the description I'm going to like give you a link so uh, you can just take a look at the picture of these um, settings but you can just pause the video here right now and you can copy these settings down so yeah and once you've imported that color corrector you want to go down to sharpen and you want to drag reset the none in because it, create, it makes the sharpen look very nice like it makes the quality like crystal clear then you want to go down to on sharp mask and you want to drag in this and just basically pause the video and copy this down okay and what you want to do is when you're rendering you just want to click and highlight the video and make sure this is on best full so you get the best quality go to file go to render as um, these aren't my rendering settings, and the, these are Tiscope's rendering settings, so yeah. Um, subscribe to him if you want, he's got pretty good videos. So you make sure that these three boxes are checked, render loop region only, stretch video to fill out pre frame box, and see if project markers and media file, make sure they're corrected. And um, go to custom, and um, basically you can just pause the video and take down these settings. Uh, make sure this box is unchecked because it messes up your quality if it's checked. Uh, once you do that, click OK. And just click Save, and that's basically it done. Thanks for watching this video. Comment, rate, and subscribe.